Hello and welcome to Safe Secure Surfing's DNS leak test for private internet access. Today we're going to check if your if this VPN service is keeping the your privacy and your location hidden. So we're starting out from the Midwest near Chicago with the VPN service turned on. And we're going to visit three different sites today. We're going to go to dnsleaktest.com dnsleak.com, dns-leak.com, and each one of these will show us how well the VPN service is working. So we'll start off, we can do two tests on our very first one here, dnsleaktest.com does a standard test and an extended test. So we'll see how many service, servers that it is picking up with both the standard test and the extended test. So we'll start with the standard test and see what this shows us. Okay, it's showing us just one server found with one query round. Now if we go back and we do the extended test, it does it six times and it will show us how many servers are being found with each of these query rounds. Once again, showing us in the same location and it's showing that we are only showing one VPN, one uh, server being found in each location. We'll head over to dnsleak.com mm -hmm. and we'll do the same test and see what comes up. Okay, so it's showing us that we've got one server, and it looks like we're not leaking according to dnsleak.com. Let's go over to dns-leak.com and see what they show us. Alright, once again it's showing us just one server, so all three of these are in agreement. All three of the websites are showing us we have just one server, which is what we want to see. So we're going to go over here and we're going to disconnect from Private Internet Access's VPN service and we'll revisit all three sites and see what we're showing for leaks. So we'll go back and we'll start with dnsleaktest.com. We'll refresh it. And we'll do a standard test. And it's showing that we have three servers found. So we'll go back and we'll do the extended test. and it's showing between three and four servers found on this one. So we'll head over to dnsleak.com and we'll refresh it and start our test again. So it's showing us that we've got one, two, three servers it looks like and we're leaking which is what we expected because we turned off the VPN service. So I'll go over to dns-leak.com, we'll refresh it and see what it shows us for how many servers and stuff are coming up. Once again we're showing four servers coming up. So what I'll do is I'll do up a summation of this and uh, I'll be back shortly. Alright, so I've put together a chart summing up all the results from before private internet access was launched and after private internet access was launched looking at the DNS leaks. Once again we did dnsleaktest.com dnsleak.com dns-leak.com so all three websites were showing leaks before private internet access's VPN service was launched we had four, service, four servers detected on dnsleaktest.com, three servers on dnsleak.com, and four servers on dns-leak.com. After private internet, internet access was launched, all three of them were showing no DNS leak. They were showing only one server detected, the one that we had selected for the, for the test. So this looks really good. Private internet access is providing secure service with which we can surf the internet with, providing us with only one server, the one that we've selected in whatever country that we're looking at it from. So our privacy is, our privacy is being protected really well. well. Thanks for watching. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them below. Also be sure to check out the full review that we have on our website, as well as links to other videos that we have for Private Internet Access's review. Once again, thanks for watching and have a great day.